We have a News Nation exclusive along the southern border this evening. It's 30 feet tall, made of steel, and it came with a price tag north of $11 billion. But cutting through the southern border wall has been no problem at all for smugglers of illegal immigrants. So, how do they pull it off? With ease, as it turns out, and at times with attitude. And today we caught. It all on camera. This video was taken at the border between Lukeville, Arizona and Mexico. It appears to show smugglers using a saw and a generator to make a hole in the wall, and it worked for them. We saw several migrants walking right through that gap and into a new life here in the United States. As our News Nation Southwest correspondent Ali Bradley explains tonight, cartels are finding it increase are finding increasingly creative ways to Just smuggle people into the U.S. Yeah, Connell, it's work smarter, not harder down here for the criminal cartels who have figured out that it's more efficient to go through the wall than it is to go around it or over it. So take a look at what we witnessed out here. In Lukeville, we watched as cartel SUVs started showing up and escorting eight migrants from Peru through a previously cut gap in the border wall. As you can see, one of the smugglers even flexes for our cameras in the gap. Once back on the Mexican side, he waved me over. Something that definitely gave me pause. You want me to come to you? What do you got? You have a gun? Are you gonna hurt me? Huh? You have a gun or are you gonna hurt me? You want me? You're not gonna hurt me, right? You want me. No? I come to you? ¿Qué pasó? ¿Cómo se llama? Yo? Si. Sí. Hey. Me llamo Ali. No. Eres un cartelo, no? No. No? Coyote? No. Si. Sí. Eres un coyote? No. No. Ando checando aquí nomás. Okay. Yeah. You filming me too? Yeah. Yeah. So he continued to film me the entire time, and yes, we filmed back. That man would not give me his name or how much he was being paid for his smuggling efforts. As you heard, he claimed not to be a coyote despite acting as one. Hours later, we caught the same men trying to saw a new hole into the slats before a Border Patrol vehicle arrived at the scene. Afterwards, we got a look at their handiwork, slicing into steel and concrete at least six inches thick. Now, this all comes, Connell, as Border Patrol sources tell me that they're being advised to process as many people as quickly as possible in the busiest sector along the southern border because... As you know, their role is usually to deter illegal immigration and combat those criminal cartel members. Thanks so much for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.